So I know that many of you use Chrome, but I noticed there was a really simple way to, to store prompts inside of the place where you might be accessing a, um, a, open, a open chat tool. Here's ChatGPT, by the way. This is what Google Gemini looks like here. Um, but let's say I have a prompt. I want to use it in both of these tools. Well, this is so simple. I know you're going to roll your eyes, but it's really helpful if you don't have a uh, approved template generator. Inside of Microsoft Edge, uh, the big browser for Edge, there is a little plus button up here that's, that's called collections. And I said, I wonder if that's going to let me collect a bunch of things there. So I clicked on that collections and I said, oh, I can create a new collection. So I clicked on that. And then when I, when I clicked on that collection, nothing was here, but I noticed a little three dot button here. You can see my generic uh, prompts right there. So if I click that three dot button and say, add note, I have a little place where I can start to add a series of prompts. And the way that I would use it is let's close it on up and let's, um, let's pretend that I'm going to use it right now. I say, oh, I've got to send something here. I want to send a really smart uh, request here with lots of context. Oh, let me go get my, my generic prompt. I would just click once, twice, highlight, control C, control V, right? And then I can fill it in here. Now, one little zip tip is that if you press shift and you hit enter, it doesn't send the message. So it gives you a little bit of flexibility to copy and paste things in there. Shift plus enter. It also works if you're sending a Microsoft Teams chat and you want to just have two separate lines. You don't want to hit enter and send it. That also is just a great little zip tip here. Shift enter allows you to kind of paste down, maybe put a couple notes below this. And now you can fill this in like a little form uh, that, it, that will actually be much easier uh, for it to understand. Maybe you would normally forget to mention tone and word count or structure of message. And of course, you can say, I'm not going to do all this. I just want to mention these three here, or these four here. You know, but it gives you the ability to take a little structure and power up uh, your, your chat capabilities. So you find the stuff that you need faster, and that's what it's all about.